Azerbaijan, you have the floor. Thank you, Mr. President. We have taken the floor to exercise the right of reply to the remarks made by the delegation of Armenia that contains incorrect information and traditional absurd allegations against Azerbaijan. To clarify some allegations raised by Armenian delegate, Azerbaijan as a country suffering from the tragic consequences of occupation of its territories, the protection of cultural heritage is always significant and sensitive issue for Azerbaijan. The allegations concerning the destruction of the cemetery is another attempt of Armenia to mislead the international community from the aggravated facts of ethnic cleansing and cultural cleansing carried out in the occupied territories of Azerbaijan by the Republic of Armenia. Since the beginning of 1990s, cultural and religious heritage representing the very richness of Azerbaijani culture has, have been savagely damaged and ruined by Armenia, not only in the occupied Nagorno-Karabakh region of the Republic of Azerbaijan and the seven uh, surrounding districts, but also within Armenia itself. The destruction of the ancient Agadada Mosque and the cemetery in the Masis region of Armenia is one of the many examples of cultural heritage and uh, terrorism against Azerbaijan. It is ironic that the Armenian representative speaks in defense of importance of preservation of cultural heritage and condemns my country. Over the course of armed conflict between Armenia and Azerbaijan, it is not, Azer it is not Azerbaijan but Armenia that has now turned it into a mono-ethnic country, a rare example in the South Caucasus, and has pursued a policy of transforming into a monoculture society by wiping out the centuries-old cultural and historical heritage of its ethnic Azerbaijani population. Furthermore, as Armenia has continued the same policy in the occupied Azerbaijani territories of Nagorno-Karabakh and surrounding regions in a more violent and destructive nature. The Organization of Security and Cooperation in Europe and its fact-finding missions in 2005 and 2010 have reported on the destruction of cultural heritage in the occupied territories of Azerbaijan. That includes looting of museums, destruction of monuments of historical, cultural, religious significance, attempts at changing the facts on the ground. The sole aim of the policy, which continues to this day, is to rewrite the history of the occupied regions on the basis of falsified sources. In Azerbaijan, we take pride in our respect for the history and culture of all ethnic and religious minorities. The best example is the Armenian church that stands in the central square of capital Baku. Besides, currently there are 30,000 Armenians living in Azerbaijan, which clearly dem demonstrates the policy of intercultural tolerance existing in Azerbaijan when in Armenia left no one Azerbaijan. In the conclusion, if the Armenian delegation is going to take second right of reply, I would like to invite him Thank to you. bring the facts to the document. Thank you.